I mean, the one thing that I love most is to come from the South uh, of seeing a lot of racism, like black and white, and never being able to communicate. Like my first time I ever had real uh, communication with another race was when I got to California. And to be able to, you know what I'm saying, I've been to jail over 10 times, got two felonies on my record. Um, to be able to come out here and, and, and turn my whole life around and now be able to communicate to Muslims, Christians, blacks, whites, um, go to Israel, go to China and bring all these cultural people together. So in essence, I think that I was blessed with the gift of trust, meaning a lot of people put trust in me, the spirit that I put off as soon as you meet me. I don't want anything from you because I believe in my own dream. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, I'm able to bring together culturals and, 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 and different people, different ethnicities. And I'll give you an example. Like even with my event that I do called Speak Dreams Wealthy Wednesday, you got four motivational speakers up there with four different religious beliefs that all set their personal religious beliefs to the side for the common good of helping people. Mm -hmm. The fact that you can do that. I challenge anybody, any leader out here, you let your ego go, man, and let's do what we said we want to do. If we're here for the people, it's not about you anyway. So that's, that's, what, that's what I'm for. I'm not a perfect individual. I don't claim to be, but I like making mistakes because you learn from them. I just want to meet the person before me that made a million mistakes so I can cut mine in half. Um, as far as, as, far as uh, ever thought about giving up, I've, I've, like I said, I have down days where some days I'm not happy with where I'm at with my vision. And I think that's just anybody. And when you have a true wealthy mind, it's like even if I became a billionaire, you want to be a trillionaire. So I don't think the type of person that I am, I would ever be happy with where I am. So what I've learned is, I wrote this new quote that say, what if you work so hard to gain everything you wanted, only to lose everything you needed? Mm -hmm. And so what that means to me is we as people need to appreciate where we are right now in our life and just be thankful for where we're at today because we might not wake up and get to be where we truly think we should be. And that's why I'm, I, as far as give, giving up, I don't have no doubts about giving up because my trust is not in no man, it's not in no human. My trust is in me and my faith in God. And I believe that I'm going to get whatever it is that I want. And when you generate results, can't nobody argue with that. And that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to let my work speak for itself, and I'm going to close my mouth. The, the, the trip to Mecca, man, and the, the trip to, I took a trip to Israel as well. Um, it's life-changing, bro. You know, I look at it like, I wanted to know why Malcolm X went to Mecca. And I want to see the same things that they see. You know, if you elite, I want to understand what my message of speaking dreams into existence mean. And... I can't even really explain it and put it into words, but you get to really go. I went over there and I got closer to God, closer to my religion. Um, I got closer to stepping into my truth, meaning it's okay for me to be me. It's okay for me if the world wants to call me selfish. You don't, every time someone calls you something, you don't have to come back with that, meaning you don't have to retaliate. You know what I'm saying? Because if you really, and, when, and the reason I say that is because I come from a hood and a lot of people will make you feel you should be selfish because you want to be a billionaire. Now the opposite of being selfish is everything you gain, give it to everybody else. Now what sense does that make? <laughs> so I'm not doing, I'm not going to sit here and lie to nobody. I love myself first before I love you. Because I can't give you true love if I don't love me. Thank you for watching A Wise Way. Subscribe to stay updated, share to pass the knowledge, or view our other videos on the left.